Uh, I'd just like to hear your view on SIG Energy, the team in China, and the factory itself. Yeah, well, Jay, um, it was actually nice to go visit the place where all the hype is coming from right now in the industry. Um, yeah, so, I mean, like I said, we were there for quite some time. We spent some time with Jay and with his team, Ken Troy, Tony, the CEO of, of SIG Energy. And I um, mean, we visited the R and D centers. We visited the factory. We spent some time with the guys. Had some dinner with them. with casual discussions and all of that. And I must say, you know, um, really impressed. Um, manufacturing process is top notch. Um, really, really brilliantly set up. And um, what what's actually one of the most amazing things is that the product actually powers the facility. So. Um, one of the main reasons why we went there was to see the whole thing around the zero millisecond changeover, you know, about being a non-believer in that um, since the start. And what's just one of the main reasons why I went there to you know, see how it's done. And Lucas was there to kind of launch this with. And yeah, proud to say that I was wrong <laughs> and that they really are achieving a zero millisecond changeover. Um, Do you want to elaborate maybe on it? Well, the the it, it's it's quite a technical technical way in the way that they do it, and uh, we've got a nice technical document that we received from them. So for all the engineers out there that is looking for it, it's freely available, so you can see exactly how it is being done. And but basically, long and short is they sense the grid and him uh, dropping out, and the inverters actually take over mm. before the grid top drops out so that you do not have the on-off changeover. So basically, it's just a ride-through in, in um, VSG mode, and it just takes over the entire load, and it basically just releases the grid. So I'm oh, really amazed at you know, how they've done it. And uh, something that no other products achieve. Nothing that I've seen so far, and as I believe from what I've heard, is that they've actually gone and patented the idea so it's going to be very difficult to copy and it was really out of the box thinking um so yeah i mean the thing that amazed me most is either we were with the team on monday and we had to know with them and we discussed a few you know technical aspects and things that we would like to see you know somewhere in the future yeah and wednesday when we had a meeting they actually presented the solutions to us so Really impressed that their turnaround time was so so quick, um, you know, and that they they just shows the the R and D team how strong the R and D team actually is, um, with all of the engineers that they have there, mm. they they're really quick on on doing things. And seventy percent of the company is yes, R and D. Yeah, yes. No.